Hello YouTube and welcome back to my channel. I am your girl Vita Bellanoria across all my social media platforms and we're not going to do too long of an intro because you already know why you're here. You're here to see the clothes. <laughs> so this first haul is going to be sports athletic type gear and also a way that you can actually go ahead and expand out your current fall winter wardrobe without having to spend so much money on so many brands just by adding in a few key pieces that will mix and match throughout your wardrobe so you're able to expand your wardrobe while still keeping it budget friendly okay this part of the haul is going to be a puma haul so this is everything puma from this season where i got them from and how you can save some money and not have to pay full price on your athletic winter gear or your yeah athletic winter gear in your sweatsuit so if you're ready let's go ahead and get into the haul you're my bitter one taking me home one thing really do one. okay guys so the first part of this puma haul is going to be coming in from Coles, and i can't remember where i got this one from Yes, this one is either Coles or Foot Locker. I'll leave the information for you guys on the screen. And because all I have is the tag information, I have to go back and pull out the invoice for it. But um, yeah, I thought that, okay, let's go ahead and show you the fit first. So it has, this is the Puma gray and black, has the Puma coming across from the ankle coming up to the knee, going at a diagonal coming up your leg. And the sweatshirt is just a regular sweatshirt with Puma diagonally coming up across your actual body. So I love this. The one thing I will say that I didn't know is Puma runs and is cut a little bit smaller than Nike, Champion, Adidas, and all of these other brands. Camp, Kappa, Billionaire Boys, uh, Chris, they, it's kind of cut the same way that Black Pyramid by Chris Brown is cut. I have one of those hauls coming up for you guys too. So this one is a slimmer cut. So this one is <laughs> snack, snack. I'm a normal 22, 24 in women. Normally 3X, 2X, 1X, depending on the actual material, how it's cut and how it fits. But this is a 2X in men, top and bottom. And this is the way it fits. The pants are fine everywhere else, but once it gets up to my butt area, it starts to get like super tight. So yeah, whatever. Anyway, I only wanted the top in this because I knew, like I told you guys earlier, you can mix and match more affordable pieces when you're going out buying more expensive pieces. So I know I wanted the top in the Puma, but I have the blue regular square pants I could wear to match it out and just throwing some pumas with it and call it a day. So I thought I went ahead and got the whole fit of this to actually match. I thought I got the gray and black bottoms and the gray and black top. I placed about two different orders for several different pieces I was looking for as they was coming in and out of stock from Coles, I'm pretty sure from Coles. I'll leave the information. So I thought my first order I had ordered the top and I was waiting on the pants to come back in stock. So. I'm thinking I already have pants, I just need a top, or I'm thinking I already have a top, I just need pants. So my first order, I ordered the pants. Second order, God darn it, if I didn't go back and order the exact same pants. <laughs> so I had to hop online and see, this is at Kohl's. I hopped online and see if they actually had the top to this in stock, and they did, and I went ahead and ordered it. So I'll go ahead and slip that in in a future upcoming haul for you guys, but. Yeah, don't be like me. <laughs> look at your past orders. Go back to your email. Look at your invoices and see, did you already order the pants so you're not ordering the same pants all over again? But yeah, this is the fit from Puma. No, I'm definitely not going to wear this together, clearly, obviously. And this is the next t-shirt top I got in from Puma. It's actually more of like a silver metallic black with camo, with gray camo running across it. So it's outlined in the gun matter, gun, gun, gun metal metallic, and the inside is the shiny um, camouflage, gray and black camouflage. So that's your Puma top. Pretty plain, 
nothing else on the back or anything like that, but pretty plain. So I went ahead and grabbed the Puma t-shirt. Since the weather is starting to now change here in Atlanta, we're starting to go through those days where sometimes it could be in the 30s highs, and then two days later the high be 60, 65, 70, so I can throw on a light jacket in the midday when it starts to creep up, I can just take it off and be free. So let's go ahead and take a look at the next piece. And this is the next piece in from Puma. This is t-shirt material, so it is light. It's just a long sleeve t-shirt. So this is great for spring and for fall for you guys. And also coming up on those days where, again, it's 30s, 40s starting out, and by afternoon, evening time, it crept up to 65, 68, 70. So this would be great for you during that time of day. And it has Puma going down both sleeves, wrapping around both sleeves. Nothing on the back, Puma on the other sleeve too. And it's the black cross blocking right here. So it blocks across the chest. I'm pretty sure it's, since this is men's, it's like supposed to make look more appealing, their pecs. But for me, it's just boobs. So it's like, hey, it's just, it's, it's just, it's just boobs. Get a little closer so you guys can see. So it says since 1948 on the sleeve with Puma. And again, I'm sure this is for men's chest to make it look, but I just have boobs. So if you're getting this, I got this from Coles, guys. Um, and it was on sale, and I think it's still on sale. But um, yeah, I'm gonna leave the information from the tag and everything so you guys can see it as well. Um, on the screen and also in the description box below, but ladies, when you're shopping in the men's section, certain things that are meant to really pop out on men's clothing to accentuate, you know, biceps and different things like that, <laughs> don't care, you can still wear it. But when it comes to chest pieces, <laughs> just know it's gonna pop out your boobs. Just know. Okay, this is the next piece we got in from Puma. This is also from Kohl's Men's 2XL. Information will be on the screen in the, in, in the description box. But this is the army gray one. But just Puma and, you know, the cat on the front. But it's plain. Nothing else on it. But I got this to match some of my green sneakers that match this perfectly. So I went ahead and picked this one up as well. A little bit closer so you guys can see. Just the cat. So this is the green Puma piece, and this thing is hot. <laughs> I hate trying on clothes. Like even when I go to the dressing rooms and stuff, I just be like, Jesus, it's hot. Just put it in the bag so I can go. <laughs> but this is the Puma hoodie, guys. Okay, guys, and this is gonna be the last piece that's coming in from Puma. It has the uh, Puma information going up and down the actual sleeves. Nothing on this sleeve, but the Puma logo and everything is going down this sleeve. The Puma cat is right here, and it does zip all the way up, and you can zip it back down if you need breathing space. But at times, I'm gonna need a little breathing space. But it does have the actual separated pockets, so you aren't able to take one hand and push it all the way through to the other side. So these are two separate pockets. Again, they do have the safety look right here, so things don't come to spilling out of your hoodie as you're busy moving around, bending over getting stuff, doing whatever you're doing in Walmart or Target. You don't have to worry about stuff coming out of your hoodie. And on the back, it has the Puma information coming down the back as well. So we're gonna go ahead and get a little closer so you guys can see it better. So here we are with the Puma information. And I love the fact that it has the double stitching around the hands and the thumbs. So you're able to push your thumb through. Or if you just wanna be normal, you can still be normal. But I love the fact that it has the thumb slits on it with the uh, double stitching with the Puma logo around the actual hands and the thumb piece on um, both of them. And there's that Puma logo I was telling you guys about. And the one on the back. So 
So this is going to be the final one that came in from the Puma haul. If you guys have any questions or anything like that, definitely feel free to ask me. Pretty sure this one is from Cove. I'm going to pull up the information. Again, you guys have already probably seen it on the screen. And again, it will be in the description box below. But here we go, guys. This is it for the actual Puma haul. Okay, if you've made it to this part of the video, then you've had a chance to see a few cute, a few key pieces and how you can incorporate them into your actual wardrobe and how you can just change it up while still being fashionable, still being on trend, but we're not trying to break the rank, so we're trying to save some money too. So hopefully you've been able to add some of these to the shopping carts because I know a lot of these items that I went over are actually on sale now. It wasn't necessarily always on sale when I bought it, but I found a coupon to make it cheaper. But that coupon would have saved me even more money now that it's on sale. <laughs> but guys, go ahead and have fun shopping. And again, you know I don't care when you're watching me. If it's in the morning, afternoon, evening, late at night, on your way to church. <laughs> I'm just happy that you decided to come spend some time with me. And again, thank you, YouTube.